Welcome, welcome back at Any Help at C-Squared. In this example, we need to find the volume and the surface area of this cone. For that reason, I'm going to use these two formula. You see down here, the volume of a cone. First one is 1 over 3 pi r squared times h. So that formula comes from this formula, where area of the base is pi r squared because we have a circle. So we have 1 over 3 pi r squared h and if we take a look in this picture we know the radius the radius is 10 and we know the height the height is 12 so it's nothing else than just replace the r and h of this value so 1 over 3 times pi times 10 square times the height which is 12 so we're going to have here 1 over 3 times pi times 100 times 12. And I'll suggest you to simplify here because it's possible. 3 goes in 12 4 times. So the volume will be here. Just 100 times 4 will be 400. Don't forget about the pi. 400 pi cubic units is the volume. We can move to... The second part, the surface area, and you notice here we have the surface area equals the lateral area plus the base, but we have also this formula, pi r l. This l is the slant height of this cone plus pi r square. And the first part is the lateral area in case you need it, and the last part is the base. But as you notice, we need to find that slant height, which is this guy right here. For that reason, I can draw this triangle. And OA is the radius. is going to be 10. And we have this 12 here. And that is a right triangle. 10, 12. And this is the slant height, which I'm going to call it X here. And I'm going to use A squared plus B squared equal c square so i'm gonna have 10 square plus 12 square equals x square 100 that is 10 square 144 is 12 square equals x square so x square will be 244 in order to find x i'm gonna take square root And that will be, in the simplified form, 2 square root of 61. Now we can go back in this formula. And we have the surface area will be pi times r. r is the radius 10. L, like I said, is this slant height, which we calculated here, 2 square root of 61, plus pi times r square r is 10 in this case 10 square so we have here 10 times 2 which is 20 20 pi square root of 61 plus 100 pi this is an answer in terms of pi of course you can factor out pi if you want or 20 pi and get a factor form but this is a good answer if you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you